Another one of those lunch boxes. shot she'd fired but she was sure it must have been more than she had in her magazine and yet she'd not run out of ammo as if the magazine had grown to fit more bullets she fired again The page said I'd run into a cultist here. On your toes, Saga. Marisetter is not afraid of the rough questions.
don't look like cultists. Feel like myself. Don't know how to fight it. We're too old. Excuse me. I'm looking for the Anderson trailer. Sweetie pie, right on time. Like we were just saying, it's not true. The lies to hurt you. And make you weak. Don't believe a word. They believe because deep down, they want to be told what to think. We're different. Rebels! You must stop it before it turns real. Don't be part of the story. Make the story. <laughs> stop the hell of it! <laughs> These old drunks don't seem affected by the horror story like the other locals are. Do they know what's happening here? How do you know about the story? Same as you, of course, sweetie pie. We are family. The Andersons. Vikings. Gods. It's so good. To finally see you, Saga. I am your great uncle Odin, and this is your long lost Murfar, Thor. Sarasoga. He is your grandfather, and I am the old father. <laughs> Just as crazy as everyone else. Just as caught in it. I need to stay focused. I need to check out the trailer. You have things to do. Makes sense. Think, Saga. Your name is Anderson? Same as you, kiddo. Tor Anderson, Odin Anderson, the old gods of Asgard. That's our band. You're... You are Saga Anderson, goddammit. A Viking goddess. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Tor, Odin, Saga. All Norse-inspired. Plus the same last name. A coincidence? Did the horror story change their names to match mine? So, do you know where the Anderson trailer is? Right behind us. We've been looking after it since you left. Uh-huh. Thanks for your help. Anytime, kiddo. It looks like you two have had a bit too much fun. She sees right through us, bro. She has the power. 
This calls for a fucking celebration! Our little saga all grown up and finally home. Sure, we've had a few sips. Just a taste. The famous Anderson moonshine. Oh, the nectar of the gods. You want some? No, thanks. Have you seen any strange people in deer masks? I haven't drunk enough for that yet. You can see all sorts of wonderful things when you make your way down the bottle. Even more so with just one eye. Okay. Never mind. like that. Deer Fist is almost here, which means we're just topping the prices of all of our custom-designed Deer Fest parade clothes. Floats created by the award-winning team at Kalevala Knights Motorcycle Club, winners of last year's trophy for best Deer Fest float featuring an animal that is not deer. That very team. And you're gonna get a kick out of our latest float design. We've done it all. Deerfest floats, restaurant floats, floats shaped like things we can't show on television. Our floats are the best way to impress your friend, propose to your partner, or throw shade at an office colleague. And we don't do just Deerfest. Our floats are a perfect gift for weddings, birthdays, for a mitzvahs, or your area. Our floats will punch up any special occasion. <laughs> Why take our work for it? Let's hear it for me. One of our many, many happy customers. I was the deer man last year. Reeks of booze. A pun book from Elmo. Are we close in the story? That might explain some of his behavior. Did I leave the Bureau in this fictional reality? Addressed to me from years ago. Wake was right. The horror story is changing reality, not just people's memories. This card has mom's handwriting. Everything here reminds me of Logan. This could be her room. This is getting too real. Too personal. The Nordic Tales book Mom gave to Logan when she was little. Logan's junior agent certificate. 
So cute. Bon. Logan used to love her music. Your double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people. My newfound relatives, cozy with the cult of the tree. And that's the clicker, in the hands of the cult, just like the page promised. Carly Valla Knights. That's the motorcycle club the Costello brothers are in. I'll take Odin and Tor up on their offer and visit their nursing home, right after I find this biker workshop. No. It's, it's not true. It's just a fucking story. It's not true. Logan's back home. She's fine. Fuck. She's at school. David? Is Logan okay? Call me back as soon... Mulligan? What the fuck? Hey! Stay where you are! Mulligan is a cultist? What the fuck is going on here? No, that is not going on the board. Some real things are mixed in with the fiction. Doesn't matter. It's not real. It's not. Logo 
it wasn't real. Don't think about it. The cult has the clicker. Get it? Fix this. Stop right there. The shape stumbled out of the dark toward Deputy Mulligan. Thornton was doubled over, coughing. A chunk of cold pastrami caught in his throat. Bring it, fucker! Mulligan fired. Thornton hacked the pastrami out of his windpipe, opened fire with his partner. The monster fell. They kept shooting. The thrill of domination. This was the cult of the tree. Not one tree. A forest. Secret knowledge in a deer mask. The last line of defense. yippee ki motherfucker. Bright Falls, fucking finest. They crept over, pulling out their flashlights. The horror. This is Monica from the tackle shop. An innocent woman. Thornton's pastrami came back up. I feel bad for these guys.
The photo proved the cult had the clicker. Tor and Odin were in it too. Worth following up on later. Locked. They must be in there. There has to be a way to get this lock open. This is the cult's hideout. Their headquarters, even? A fuse. Could come in handy. There's a basement. The Nightingale ritual wasn't completed. The cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. The cult isn't well organized. People aren't following orders. This will be handy. That's it. This is the cult's process. Their ritual. This is one weird cult. Rose. She's that waitress from the diner. That's not right.
Creepy basement. Shit. Hey, freeze. Watch They're playing with me. I was so close. Mulligan and Thornton are members of the cult. Who's the leader? Brains leaking out like ilk. The thrill of domination. Not one tree. A forest. The word. A secret like this doesn't die. There is more than one leader. There was another overlap here in Watery. The parade float was the key. Mulligan and Thornton had gone there, taken the clicker, left this monster here to stop her. There's an overlap here, like there was at Cauldron Lake. Mulligan and Thornton, a light nightingale. Inside, waiting. And a parade float is the key. The victim was one of their own. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale, gone missing here 13 years ago. Now he had suddenly turned up, only to be murdered in a brutal ritual on the very day of their arrival. And then there was the page. This page. The first page that they had found. Not the last. The first step down into terrifying depths. Secret truths trembling beyond the threshold. Reading the words, these words, felt like a message was a message. Someone knew they were here, what they were doing. Someone playing a game with them, leading them on. An invitation. How could they not accept? The sheer audacity of this impossible mystery presented to them, even if they knew it would end up hurting them. Saga had read about it. The trap. She knew what was waiting for her. The moment she saw the giant, she knew she wasn't ready. You let Logan drown. The weapon it carried could crack her skull like a brittle egg. Brains leaking out like yolk. Everything she loved, lost. Everything she was, lost. We will watch it eat your mind. Reading this made her sick. But the fear was sharp when she faced it. There was another overlap here in Watery. The parade float was the key. Mulligan and Thornton had gone there, taken the clicker with them, left this monster here to stop her. Mulligan and Thornton were fine earlier. How did this happen? A terrible mistake. Shadows crept over Mulligan and Thornton. Shadows on their faces, filling the shape of them. 
Bright Falls fucking finest. Shitty pastrami sandwich. Mulligan and Thornton became like Nightingale. Upstairs. This was a trap. 